they essentially could build a, a very small residence or very large residence that would be up to their choice without so no, I, I do recall uh, recall a lot of developers at the time having a lot of uh, questions about that. Mm -hmm. All right. Any other discussion about the commissioners? There being none, I will now entertain a motion from the commissioners. Yes, Mr. Commissioner, I would like to recommend approval of REZ 2013-11. Uh, with the one acre lots as recommended by staff uh, and uh, any other conditions that the staff has put on there also. Second. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, I just want to, just to make sure, I mean, the, with what you phrased, you could actually have R21 zoning with a one acre condition, or are you proposing the R1 zoning like what staff recommended? The R1 zoning, too. Okay. I'm okay. still learning the R's and the Z's. <laughs> we have a motion by Commissioner Hall, and I think I heard a second by Mr. Commissioner Rector. Um, is there any discussion on the motion? I'd like, as a point of discussion, just to state that uh, that at, at some point in time, I think uh, we all uh, kind of have density problems and <clears throat> with uh, development, etc. But the state of the economy, and, it's, and uh, from what I can tell from visiting this site, it would not adversely impact if it was R21. Um, you need to think about development families. Uh, I think it would fill a need, definitely, for this type of um, price range. Around, I think it was 150, 180,000 somewhere around there, and uh, certainly create some employment. And the Lord knows we need that. So. I would just like the commission to consider that uh, maybe R21 at this point in time would be something that they would <coughs> want to recommend to, uh, to the commission. Mr. Did you want to talk? I was just, I was, Mr. Chairman, I just want to echo Mr. Cheryl's thoughts there that the half acre lots is where this land needs to be. I mean, it's the one acre lots is basically dead in the water. Uh, as far as I know that most folks are not worth that much acres to cut, upkeep, and uh, as is the point of economics, it is more reasonable use of the land for uh, housing. All right. <laughs> I, I, I was just going to say that today will not always be today. Uh, we're looking down the road, and, and once these get built, you can't change it. Uh, I know times are tough right now, but you know, taking the quick dollar is not always the best solution for, for long-term long planning. Uh, I, I agree with Commissioner Hall. I, uh, I just think one acre is, is the way to go. I, I know it's, it's tough right now. Well, if I may, I, I wanted to say that to me, the density is not the issue. It's really the arrangement of the lots on, the, on this long side that really lacks innovation and if it's done in a more creative way it would be it may be a bit more acceptable. Um, that's, that's all I want to add. All right. If there's no other discussion we have a motion and a second on the on the floor. Uh, Chairman. With Mr. Hall's motion, where were there were two conditions, one with access, one with ownership. Are you wanting to carry both of those on or just the yes. access? Both on. Carry both of them on. All of the recommendations that y'all made. Okay. Well, we had a ruling from the attorney. I wasn't sure if you wanted to keep ownership on there or just leave the access. Oh, okay. I say that. Well, if, they, if that requirement's been fulfilled already, then there's no need to keep it on there. Okay. Okay. But the second condition was everything will face the interior road. Yeah. Yes, sir. And that's, that's the one I'm most concerned about. Right. Absolutely. All right, we have a motion and a second. All in favor, do so by raising your hand. All 
those opposed? All right, the motion uh, fails two to five. I will not entertain another motion. Mr. Chairman? Uh, this uh, development, if unapproved by the commissioners, will probably not happen, I would think. Uh, I don't think it's financially feasible for a developer to go in there with um, and be restricted to that size of lot uh, R1. Therefore, and for the other uh, stipulations that we have mentioned before, I think we can, can, can keep these conditions um, in here, but actually, uh, I think we need to grant the request R21. I think it does meet the basics of the uh, comprehensive plan. And I would uh, urge the county commission to approve this project. Right. We have a motion by Commissioner Cheryl. Second, yes, sir. Second by Commissioner Bailey. Any discussion on the motion? Sir, I'm sorry. I just want to check. Is that with the conditions or not? With these, um, for the signatures and for the frame of the interior roads. Okay. So, basically, it's the request that the applicant made. I understand. Commissioner Wells? Um, I'd like to, if you would modify it to where, at the time, water, uh, the utilities reach that area, it, uh, that attached to the attached to You mean water and sewer, or just water? Water, especially water. You don't have a safety tank; they're already there. So, okay. So, what does the county like whenever they, they want both? They, if, if the safety tank is there, you can't take it away from them. No, I mean it's yeah, just, uh, it's just water. Water. <coughs> water, water. I think water would be the one. Any other discussion on the motion? What, so the, what is the amendment to, to provide? When the, when the water gets to that area, whether it's annexed into the city or if it's a county, uh, water reaches that area, it is converted to the county. I think water is a well, state road now. Yes, well, that's not a land use issue. Can we actually, I mean, that's something that needs to be as a condition to the development. It's not. He's already offered that. He offered it. That's the reason I'm putting it on there. Mm. Okay. But, 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 but it shouldn't it, just curious, shouldn't it, if we're going to make it a condition, shouldn't it be water and sewer rather than just water? Well, can no. you do that after a second really? I think. Well, he's going to have a well there, too. I think one, if he's going to have a community water system. So if the county all of a sudden ran a line down Orr Road, then there would be some kind of arrangement or agreement to where possibly the developer might abandon the water system and now it would become a county system. Mm -hmm. But to, you know, that's one scenario. To take the sewer line there, these homes are going to have a septic tank. So now to say that you now have to abandon your septic tank and connect to a county, county sewer system is a different no. You know, it's yeah. a different thing to connect the community water system to the county line than it is to have an individual property owner abandoned. And you'll be dealing with each individual. Like what happened to the city, city yeah. Yes. Well, not, I don't know about your opinion, Franklin, but I'm just saying, <laughs> you know, the sewer and the water, exactly. the water system is, a, it can be different than if, if it was a sewer. I think sewer is a different and more difficult issue. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You offered it from what I was going to say. You know what he said, if you want to go away with it, I don't care. And the, and the water system will meet the requirements of the county? I think it's permitted by the state. I think the state actually has to get involved in okay. right. permitting the water system. Okay. As far as pipe sizes and everything, is what I was talking about. Did you? All right, we have, we have a motion in the second on the floor. Move the agenda 
Is there any other discussion on the motion? There being none, all in favor, please indicate by raising your hand. All those opposed, please indicate by raising your hand. Okay, the motion fails three to four. I will now entertain another motion. Mr. Chairman, let's structure this a different way. If we approve the subdivision rezoning from the R-A to R-21 with, with half-acre lots, is that not what we just did? I thought it was. Is that what we just did? I mean... That's what you were trying to do, but then I think you got the conditions on there that may have been what caused people to oppose it. That may be up for discussion. <laughs> okay, the, the, the motion is to approve from RA to R21 with half acre lots. That's the motion. If all lots meet condition to face inward. All right, we have a motion by Mr. Bailey, Commissioner Bailey. Second. Second by Commissioner Willis. Any discussion on the motion? There being no discussion on the motion. All those in favor of the motion on the floor, please indicate by raising your hand. All those opposed? Motion passes four to three. Other business, agenda item number eight, the attendance policy.